Don't aim, get feeling strong. Hey everybody, Coldblood FTW here. Um, just wanted to do a quick little video here um, showing you how to rank up fairly fast. Maybe the fastest way to rank up. I don't know if there's a faster way than this. Unless you glitch or something, of course. But, you know, I know a lot of people aren't looking to do that and trying to go the, you know, the high route. So here's the fastest way I know to rank up. And we're going to get into this. So here we go. And I know it's double XP weekend, so great time to take advantage of this. So basically... I would say get the M16, okay? The M16 is what's going to help you rank up the fastest because it's one of the best guns. Maybe a shotgun will work for you too, but trust me, take my advice and get the M16 because headshots are going to count. And first thing you want to do is come up here on a, on about round four. It only costs two doors. Um, pretty fairly fairly easy to get to. It's just on the top of the building here, which is Nocturne Tote. And if you're not familiar with it, I'm sure you can find this area. I'm not going to draw you a map. Um, but you want to just come up here until you have about 20,000 and take advantages of uh, insta kills like I just uh, showed there Don't necessarily grab them right away. Wait till the round starts if you can like you'll you'll see a lot of them like to spawn at the end of a round I try not to get them kill off the last little bit of zombies and then get them and then use them at the beginning of the round Like I am here because I'm telling you the first the part of this is going to be the hardest And that's like I said getting about 20,000 points just sitting up here with the m16 the higher you have it ranked up the better obviously and like i said the m16 over the shotgun because you're gonna want to go for headshots they give you the most xp that you can get other than stabbing another good idea would to be to come up here and just stab because i think you'll get even more xp and then of course it also matters if you're going for guns now if you're going for guns then just do use whatever gun you want to rank up and use this method and like I said, after 20,000, you're gonna wanna go pack a punch and get dead shot. And try to do this as quickly as you can. And I'm telling you, all you need is dead shot and an upgrade it, and then you're good here till like round 20 something. Well, not 20 something, but about 20. And uh, yeah, so like I was saying too, with the knife, that would probably be the fastest way to rank up if you just do what I'm doing and just stay up here until like round 20 or 25 even. Um, you might want because I know you can upgrade the knife and you'll get the stabbing to the one hits But in, you basically go until you can't one hit stab anymore and then just you know end the game and start over That would probably be the fastest way to rank up right now um, If you want to use a gun I highly suggest the m16 like I'm doing because I'm trying to get headshots done at the same time as well um, and the headshots like I said will rank you up very quickly and You will be able to do this strategy faster with the gun than you would a knife so I can't really even say the knife would be the fastest way. Eventually, I think if you get good at what I'm showing you here, this will be the fastest way to rank up. Um, I wanted to show you too that like as a ring of fire you would want to have on, it just melts the megatons or whatever you call them. Um, like watch, dead shot, boom, dead shot, boom. Both of them, one burst to the head and they were gone. It's round 12, but still, you'll see later on right here I kill them. Round 15, one shot bursts pretty much. And this is the third place I wanted to show you. This is right under Pack-a-Punch. And you basically want to come here as early as possible. Like, if you can go till 20 up top, it might be a little quicker. But uh, this spot's more reliable is why you want to come here. Because I think it's you have a better chance of surviving here. And they do line up a lot better. And this is, like I said, right under the stairs at Pack-a-Punch. So if you go down the stairs and you're looking at the stairs, it's to the left of it. So this is your main goal. This is where you want to get to. And just basically shoot forward as long as you can and aim for headshots. Um, I, I think I can get to like 34 or 35 and then you have to really start training down there. And you can see the pack-a-punch and everything is right here. It's just so convenient. It's very fast. And this is what's going to rank up your actual rank. I wanted to show two things or something that happens here when you do, tra or, uh, do tra um, train. Oh my god. When you camp in this spot, this is going to happen. This zombie is going to be sitting here a lot of the times. It's just up the stairs in front of you. Um, not the stairs leading up to the Pack-a-Punch, but the ones past those. You just go up there. If you find the last zombie isn't appearing, just go over to the wall right here and shoot him. More than likely, he is over there. So I just wanted to point that out. Um, and like I said, if you can go to round 20 or even 30 just knifing very quickly, that is probably the fastest way to rank up. Um, I'm, I didn't really show footage of that. I apologize for that, but I am throwing it in there because it is true. Um, stabbing is the fastest, uh, the most XP you get for a kill. 
behind, or sorry, ahead of headshots, and then just a regular kill being the least amount of XP you'll get. Um, and of course, opening doors and everything else. That's another reason why I said you want to start over as much as possible, or as much as is convenient. And this is very fast. If you get really good at this, you can do this to round 30 in like less than 40 minutes. And then just end the game and do it over again. And like I said, that's what you want to be doing if um, you're trying to rank up your actual rank and get prestiged and whatnot. If you're trying to do guns, then just use a gun and you can pretty much use anyone forward other than rocket launchers or launchers or for the exceptions of really bad guns like maybe some handguns too might not be the best to go down there but still i bet you even to the hand or the handguns would work to a certain extent and uh yeah everybody i hope this helps you guys rank up this weekend um i heard from a little birdie it was double xp i hope i'm not wrong hopefully it is and um, hope to catch you on the stream, guys. I'm going to be going for headshots, and I'm going to be using this method basically. Not basically. I sound like Mike Tyson. <laughs> don't, don't, don't hit me, Mike, if you watch this. Hopefully you watch this. Love you. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, um, hopefully it's double XP. And if, I was going to say, if you have any questions, just come hop on the stream. I'm going to start today uh, pretty much Next after the release of this video. If you're watching this video afterwards, you're more than happy to hop into a stream. I stream daily. Ask me if you have any questions about this, and I will be glad to help you out and help you rank up quicker. Get some levels up there. Let me know in the comments what you think um, and what levels you are. That'd be great. Take care, everybody.